All right, today on this 2007 Chevrolet Tahoe, we're gonna install part number WT41306 from WeatherTech. This is their cargo liner. And we're actually gonna install this on a vehicle with a third row seating. A few notes about the WeatherTech floor liner. Well, first off, it's designed and engineered in the USA, which is always good. These are custom molded to the vehicle itself using the company's exclusive rubberized rosin. I mean, it actually covers the entire floor of your vehicle to keep dust and mud from getting into your carpeting of the vehicle itself. The product itself is created from three different layers. First off, it has a, a solid inner core to help keep its shape. And the top layer is part where we all see is textured and also has a slick surface to make cleaning it pretty easy. And on the bottom half of it, it has a more grippy surface to keep it from sliding around in the vehicle. As you can see, all the WeatherTech floor mats have channels built into them to help direct water flow down to the lowest point to help drain water and mud away from your shoes, but also to keep it away from the carpet of the vehicle. And these are also available in three different colors, to so be black, tan, and gray. All right, let's go ahead and install these in the vehicle and give you a better idea how they get installed and how they look. On this particular mat, to make room for a third row seating, this actually has what's called knockouts in the mat so you can cut them out so you can fit in your seating. All right, looking in the back of the vehicle, we took the third row seats out. You can see where they sit inside the vehicle. What's gonna happen is the mat's gonna sit around all these plastic parts in the floor. Those will stay. And then also be a cutout for this section here, but that's for these parts also. And basically what we're gonna do is you can see this edge right here, this raised edge. This is actually gonna overlap part of the plastic that's on the floor of the vehicle already. All right, so basically we're just gonna just take a sharp razor knife and just gonna start scoring till we go all the way through. All right, one down, four to go. I'm gonna repeat the same process on all these knockouts here. A few minutes later, we already got our parts cut out. Let's go ahead and put it into the back of our Tahoe. You can see where we got our cut out the center section of the mat, and you can see where it's gonna lie against the plastic on the floor here. Now, if you do notice, and it's quite evident that this is sticking out right now, that's because it's been wrapped up in a box and sitting in a coal warehouse, so it's naturally it's gonna be kind of stiff still. But give it an evening in a warm environment, it'll fall into place and match the, the, the lines of the floor perfectly. At this point, we can go ahead and reinstall our seats. And with that, that finished our installation of part number WT41306 from WeatherTech, the cargo liner.